I don't know what you think you're doing. I'm being clucked at by a hen, evidently. Don't play the fool with me, young man. If I wanted to play the fool, I could be rather more convincing, I assure you. Your glib tongue does you no credit. You'd be surprised at the credit my tongue gets me, Your Reverence. <sighs> oh. I... What's going on here? It seems the revered mother is concerned about my undue influence over you. It is just concern. Your Worship, you must know how this looks. You might need to spell it out, my dear. This man is of Tevinto. His presence at your side. The rumors alone. There's no cause for concern, Your Reverence. With all due respect, you underestimate the effect this man has on the people's good opinion. Do the people know how he's helped the Inquisition? I... See, I meant no disrespect, Inquisitor. Only to ask after this man's intentions. If you feel he is without ulterior motive, then I humbly beg forgiveness of you both. Well, that's something. This sort of thing happens often, does it? <laughs> More than anyone tells you. No one knows their own reputation. Until someone helpfully informs them. There is that. She meant well, if that's of any concern. I should ask, do the rumors bother you? I wish they wouldn't disparage you. They don't know you. <sighs> they know you even less than they know me. Perhaps it's odd to say, but I think of you as a friend, Inquisitor. I have precious few friends. I didn't think to find one here. I... Don't speak. I detest confessions, and I'd like to get this over with. Allow me to say I'll stand beside you, against Corypheus, my countryman, or spurious rumor, so long as you'll have me. <laughs> 